Hunting Dakota with Roosevelt is an event that uh, supports the Bismarck Cancer Center Foundation. We try to combine the fight against cancer, the military, and the North American model of wildlife conservation. We come together to provide two days of hunting for sponsors and military people that we select that are members of the North Dakota National Guard, Army and Air, and we take them on a two-day hunt. We've all been touched by cancer. Uh, my family has, as well as many of the families in here. And our goal here is to help those families do whatever we can to support them as they go through this whole process. We start off with a banquet on Friday night where we honor the, the military. And we have a short uh, program that tells us who has benefited from the funds that were raised from the previous year's event. And then we also have a silent and live auction that's helped us raise money for the event. Well, what we hope to accomplish is to produce a top quality hunting experience, you know, fellowship, uh, build relations with landowners, and try to create something that goes beyond just raising money for a cause. This is a very special organization for me because I was at the very first meeting where we thought about doing this, but the fun thing is all these beautiful, wonderful people end up where I live in Medora, North Dakota. I happen to have cancer myself, so I'm involved in all kinds of different ways. I'm really proud to even know all these people. We started with almost nothing five years ago, and now look what it's turned into. I mean, it's magnificent, and we're going to raise a lot of money for the center. It's just a great thing to support. My role here really is, I'm not really here as a hunter. I'm here to be Roosevelt of the Roosevelt and I just want to do everything I can to perpetuate this, to keep it going, to make it bigger each year. So I try to get around to all the ranchers and farmers and all the hunters uh, and make sure they have a good time and, and uh, try to keep everything rolling. So it's really great. I was in Iraq from uh, April of 2003 to March of 2004 and never in a million years did I ever realize that something like this would ever happen. You have no idea what it means to take a vet or whoever and take them hunting on a hunt of a lifetime. And that's what this really is. What an awesome event, absolutely. I want to be part of this as long as I can.